don't have one. Everyone keeps asking me that. Um, okay, I'm gonna go. Hey, I may only be in one but he said. Boxing Day guys, welcome back to the Sullivan family, it is Boxing Day, we had a wonderful day yesterday, opening presents, opening presents in the morning was absolutely hilarious, it's magic, yeah. it was absolutely magic, the kids loved it, uh, and then our lovely lovely Christmas presents that the kids gave us as well, especially Isabel's, the amount of work that Isabel puts into making that like diary of the year and all that sort of stuff, and you know, come over here, the Barbie stuff. Oh, the Barbie stuff. Hey, no, no, I'm going to ask you that in a minute. Shh. I'm going to ask you that in a minute. I'm going to ask the kids what their favourite presents was today. Yeah, Sorry. we were very lucky. We got lots of lovely stuff We as well. did. We got some amazing stuff, especially that little diary that she does is, is really, she puts loads of effort into it as well, she? Upped she upped her game from last year. Well, it's her and Olivia, really, but um, yeah. she upped her game from last year. The one she did us last year for the first time, we had no idea about. Um, but she's up to the game this year. Definitely, definitely. It's really, really lovely too. And we, it's really lovely. And I really wanted to read through it as well and show you guys just how much effort and what you put into it because it's really, really special. It just reminds you of all the things that you do through in the year. Through in the year? Through That's in the year. The word. But through the year. Um, we'll get that in the dictionary next year. It just, sometimes you don't even realise you've made that many memories when you have. Do you know what I mean? Because mm -hmm. sometimes it all just goes by so quickly and you kind of just get caught up in life that you forget these are all the things that the kids well also as parents you give yourself a hard time all the time that you don't do no, enough you do, for your kids but you don't do enough uh, um, for the, um, the, the reality is you do a lot for your kids so stop giving yourself a hard time isn't it that's the reality of it all christmas dinner didn't go as planned yesterday it was nothing short of a disaster it's horrendous I'm honest, it was horrendous. Brewers Fair we went to in link with an Elgin. Uh, I can't. Anne said the B word. <gasps> shut up. Did she? Yeah. She told you to shut up. I think you lot need to get out for some fresh air. Yeah, we're going out for a walk in a minute. Yeah, link with an Elgin. Uh, the Brewers Fair there had an absolute disaster yesterday. Um, I can't even begin to tell you how much of a disaster it was. Um, there were people getting up and leaving. Uh, there were people waiting to be seated for up to an hour. We arrived at one o'clock. Uh, we didn't get any welcome drinks that we were supposed to get that we were paid for, that we paid for. Um, and then we waited that and I don't good. know what that was. That did not sound good. We waited an hour for the starter. We then got the starter and then we waited over another hour until I'd finally broke and I went up to the management and said, where is our dinner? Where is it? You know, the kids were being so well behaved oh, as they well. they were brilliant. They were honestly, the kids were so well behaved just today. I mean, by that point, we were in there for two and a half hours, so, weren't we? It, I mean, I'm not going to go on about it too much. Because no, I'm it's not. a separate matter, but it was a disaster. Yeah. And it wasn't just us. It was every single person in there were waiting like two hours for their mains. Um, and nothing went according to plan. And when we did finally get the food, it was pretty shocking. To be honest. <laughs> um, and it was cold and it just wasn't yeah. the experience that we promised everybody, no. you know, we were treating everybody to a, a lunch out and it was really, really disappointing because I mean, some of them couldn't even, some of them didn't even touch their food because they were hungry, but the food was <laughs> really terrible. Um, and obviously it's, like I said, I'm not going to, I'm not nah, going to dwell on it because I don't want it to, but it did take it's up. Not, it's not ruining our Christmas, <laughs> put it, it that took way. Up the majority of our day, so the rest of the plans kind of went out because we didn't get home until half past four. Half past four I in think. the end, yeah. Um, yeah. <clears throat> but anyway, 
I'm not gonna. No. It's just... Stop talking about that now. So we're just what we're just trying to say is, lunch didn't go quite 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 to plan yesterday. Are you right, Joseph? Yeah. How you doing? Joseph was brilliant yesterday at the restaurant. He was you so were. Well behaved, he? he was such a good it was boy. Such a lot for mm -hmm. him as well, and he. By the end of it, he was kind of really getting. Yeah. He was spinning on the spot and and really just wanted to catch on. I want to go home. I want to yeah. go home. And we were. It's it's really difficult because you're torn between just wanting to get him out of there because it's obviously really stressful for him, but equally everybody else was waiting and they were hungry and we were and we'd paid for it. So you kind of like what you do. And in the end. I mean, <laughs> we did get our desserts, and then we just kind of we left desserts left. were all right. We left after that, and um. But anyway, that's not dampened our spirits at all. It's not dampened our Christmas spirits. It's a little <laughs> bit frustrating, and we will be looking for a refund on that. But whatever, that's a whole other story. So today we're making up for the dinner yesterday by doing an amazing. I say we, Zoe and the girls are going to be doing a buffet today of epic proportions, include a buffet of epic proportions, epic proportions, including a cooked ham, cooked turkey, all the stuff. And you, you're doing a huge buffet today and we're really looking forward to that, aren't we? I'm wondering why my socks are covered in black fluff. Uh, I don't know. Um, What's going on there? I don't want any prime So, anyway. Enough about enough about uh, lunch yesterday. I'm not talking about that anymore. Oh, we, do um, have, we do have a poorly baby flow. Yeah, we came back. We came back after after that, and um, the kids had, had their stockings. Yes. and she was happily munching away on her milky bar buttons. And, I show a fake bill. And the kids were opening their stockings, and then she started to get really upset. Come bedtime, um, she was like, like she was a tummy was sore or something, and then she was sick everywhere. Yeah. So she she seems a lot better. So today, though. she's a bit pale and a bit green, and but she was she's, sick all evening. Yeah, so <clears throat> all our plans kind of went out the window from mm -hmm. about one o'clock this afternoon. And everything kind of just went a little bit. But you know, as normal, everybody pulled together last night and um, you know got got everything sorted. Got all the little ones to bed. Yeah, we got chocolates out, didn't we? And had a bit of fun Cleaned as well. Up the so sick and yeah, <laughs> everyone, everyone. <laughs> the thing is. When things happen and when there's a bit of a crisis or when somebody's poorly or when things don't go according to plan, everybody without the older ones, especially without even needing to say anything, everybody just pulls together. Everybody takes their bit and does like, you know, well, Lizzie will be like, right, I'll, I'll go in the kitchen and do the washing up. And Mommy. the girls will be like, it's OK, we'll tidy up in the lounge. We'll do that. You sit with Flo, you bath the other ones, you know, we'll have a tidy round and you know, pick up the rest of the paper and all those. Everybody just kind of just knows to do something without yeah. even having to ask. So, yeah. you know, it's days like yesterday when things go wrong and you could kind of dwell on the negatives, you look, you have to look at the positives. Mm -hmm. And, you know, I'm really proud of how long they sat there yesterday and were really well behaved. And then when everyone pulls together as well at the end of the day, that just makes, it just makes me really proud of them all. Yeah, me too. Because so, uh, you know. we finished the day on a real Hi. high. It was really... Hi my favorite meal was the first one okay all right okay. Oh, yeah yeah anyway on to today boxing day we're going to go out for a walk in a minute so i wanted to film the um the sunrise this morning it was lovely so i went out filming the sunrise they've been basically chilling out all morning uh playing with their toys and that kind of kind of stuff agnes loves her new pens uh, we're going to go out for a walk. It's just coming up to about 11, so we're going to go out for a walk, which we wanted to do yesterday, but we think, to be honest, the weather was pants yesterday, but, but, but today the weather, the weather, there. but the weather is amazing today. It's sunny. So we're going to go, we're going to grab this bit of sunshine. We're going to go out for a walk, aren't we? Mm -hmm. Down to the woods. And then it's going to be cooking, uh, buffet, buffet, uh, and just a bit of Christmas fun, really, for Boxing Day. That's what I think, can you? Yep. Stephanie. Right, we're going to get the kids ready, guys, and we'll meet you down the woods. Light hit your face. We were just kids, but I knew right away that I will be with you until I stop breathing. I will keep loving you as long as my heart's beating. Oh, we close. Promise you won't.
Okay, you two. I want to know what was your favourite thing about Christmas Day yesterday? The presents. And what was your favourite present? I don't know. My favourite one was the Spidey car one. The Spidey car? Yeah, one. And the Mario Kart track one. What are my favourite presents? And the steering wheel are fun. I know what one of my favourite presents of Joseph's are. It's the Mario Kart one. It's one of our Joseph's. And both of our favourites is the steering wheel too. What, for the Mario Kart? Yeah. To play Mario Kart. They're fun. Funner, even funner than Mario Kart track. I really like the Prime I got. You like the Prime? <laughs> The most favourite flavour I liked is lemonade. Should we show people your Mario Kart track, Joseph? Yeah. Yes. Let's go and show people then. Yeah. Cool, okay, show us then. Okay. First, put the in. My egg. Can I press it? Okay. That's pretty cool. It is. Okay, that is a pretty cool game. Yeah. We love playing with it. Are you looking forward to having a bit of food today? Yeah. Yes. I keep on sleeping. I keep on sleeping. Come on. Alright girls. Yeah. So what was your favourite part of Christmas Day yesterday then? Oh, um, the presents. <laughs> the presents. And what was your favourite, favourite present from yesterday? Oh, yeah. She was pretty cool. And I like the Barbie. I got to see the Barbie camper and the Barbie airline. It's really smart, isn't it? Yeah. So, did you have a good day yesterday? Yeah. yeah. Good. Right, we are busy in the kitchen. Now we're back from our walk. Um, it was nice to get out for some fresh air. It's very cold, it's very fresh, but it's nothing better than looking at the sea and it's nice and sunny, even if it is cold. So we are just starting to get all the buffet food <clears throat> ready for this afternoon. Isabel is making some chocolate bark as we speak. Um, I will show you. Yep. Yeah. So just excuse all the, the food we're munching our way through. We've got dairy milk. Milky bar and Milky Bar chocolate melted and swirled together we're and then we're going to put These bits and bobs in it so we've got some Christmassy bits from Asda from Asda from last year they are actually from last year so basically that's what you do you just melt the chocolate down and then put bits in it really so we're going to put some chocolate uh, some Christmas sprinkles mm. some Santa and some these were actually cake decorations, but I think about two packs. Yeah, we do. Everyone's just munching on crisps at the moment to fill us up. All you do after you've decorated it is um, put it in the fridge. Put it in the fridge, wait for it to set, and then you just literally just crack it all up like bark. Oh, these sprinkles. We got these from um, Home Bargains, didn't we? Yeah. yeah. Keep it home bargains. No, I don't actually know if it's going in the fridge. Ah. Uh, One's all the food, so I'll have Yeah, just mm -hmm. balance it on top somewhere, it'll be fine. Maybe a few more sprinkles. Yeah. We got any other Christmassy sprinkles? Oh, we do. Maybe see some of these out. 
big this morning. Lemons are the nice ones. Really yeah, they are quite nice ones. They've got little candy canes and stuff in them. Yeah, let's see. The other ones have got. Sprinkle collection up there. We've got a lot. We need one more. Ah, yes. Those These ones. We can do some of these. Oh, that's a lot. Oh, they're cute. They've got little, little reindeer in. And hollies. Oh, they're cute. Sheep. She's been a sheep. I should do it. So that's going in the fridge. Um, I've got a turkey joint in. I'm going to put a ham. That's just Barbie. She's away in her camper van right now. Going to go and catch her plane. She's, she's, um, she's off up the corridor. Yeah, I'm going to put a ham joint in in a minute. I'm actually in the middle of doing the washing as well. We've got bits that need to go in the oven. We've got some pizzas and bits and bobs like that. Um, some fridge bits, crisps, all those sorts of things. So we're in the process. We're just starting off. So we'll come back to you in a minute. ready to smash so I'll show you. I guess it's it really looks like all set. Well, it's not fully set but it's fine. Oh is it not fully set? It's easier to bake though. You're not supposed to like smash it smash. Mm -hmm. You put it back in the fridge in this tray. Yeah. See the bottom bit's not fully set when you feel it. I don't know if you can feel it. Maybe yeah. we need to leave it a little bit longer. I mean, when it goes back in the fridge, it was solid. Oh, that's true. Okay. Mm. It's pretty much. It is. It's the middle part. The middle. The middle. So I don't eat it all. I'm not going to eat it. I know you. I'm not eating it. I've got small pieces for people who want to just try, I'll just try that bit. What? Do you like the mix between the two chocolates? Mm. Yeah, I mean. Wait, is this a stuff? I'm out of the bag up. Yeah, come on. Why? Is that too much? What? Well, that's cool. Like that. What if I bake up these pieces? Yeah. That's, that's what it's like. Mine is set just a little bit more. I think too much of this jam is 
think so. Um, so yeah, I might need to set just a little bit more. It's yummy. I'm really, really easy to make. And looks really good. We're back to cooking the rest of it. Okay, so oh. it's nearly half past three and the food is pretty much ready, all apart from some onion wings. So we have this, we have food, we have Joseph, we have all the food, we have crisps, only blueberries over there as well. We um, may or may not have eaten quite a lot of it already <laughs> as we're cooking it, but that's what you do. We have Christmas hats. So, Ben has a Christmas hat. The rest of us haven't done our crackers yet. We are going to get everybody in and make a start, I think. Are we not? Yeah. I'm just getting Ben's. Ben's. We're going to call everybody down and get everyone in for food. We're going to have our buffet. We're going to have our food. And then we're going to catch up, catch up with you after. We'll catch up with you after. Because it's going to be carnage. Right, we're going to go eat. <laughs> Okay, so the buffet was amazing. The buffet was really, really nice. Well done, Isabel and Zoe and okay. Olivia. Uh, what did I do? I, I, cut, I think I cut the meat for you. you <laughs> I was looking after it was. It was really, really good. Really good, really lovely. We're all whacked out now. We're all whacked out. That's it. Tired. The little ones are up having, uh, getting sorted out for bed. You've had a bath, just getting sorted out for bed. It's that kind of time, guys. We're going to wrap it up now. It's been a great boxing day, actually, isn't it? It's been pretty chilled out. It's been really chilled out. There's kids playing with their toys. I was having a sort out and just chilling out and watching a bit of telly and doing bits and bobs and all that kind of stuff. So it's been really good. But that's it for Boxing Day. So tomorrow, what's the day after Boxing Day? Is that the 27th? It's the 27th, then. Is it the 27th? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so it's the 27th tomorrow. So is that Vlogmas Day 27? No, it's that Vlogmas Day 28. 28. It's a vlog. I can't even remember. I'll work it out. I'll work it's it out. It's not Vlogmas anymore, anyway, is it? Because it's. Oh no, of course it's not. Because we've had Christmas. So now we're just. Now we're in the Christmas week. Yeah. Okay. That's cool. So we have Christmas Day, Christmas Eve, Christmas Day, Boxing Day, mm -hmm. and then there's that little bit in between where nobody knows what to call it. Yeah. And nobody knows what to do with themselves. Yeah. Um. And we just eat food. And some of the chocolate. Watch TV. And, and all that sort of stuff. Yeah. It's good, isn't it? I like that. Anyway, guys, really hope you've enjoyed today's vlog. Uh, another vlog coming tomorrow. Uh, we really hope you've had a good Christmas as well. Please subscribe to our channel. Please hit the bell for notifications. Drop us a like. Don't forget our links for you guys in the video description below and on our channel homepage for all of our social media as well. Facebook, Instagram and TikTok. And that just leaves me and Zoe to say, thanks for watching guys, thanks for your support, and we'll see you in the next video.